still talking about teaching a novice, but beyond the fundamentals, which are very important, we have to start teaching tactics. Ideally, a kid's imitating more experienced fighters in the gym, but you know me, we're going to use film study. Today's lesson is getting off the ropes. I'm always trying to show a kid the best example of the tactic or the technique that you're teaching them. As an illustration of a pure boxer, I like to look at Curtis Cokes. In the gym every day I heard, stay off the ropes and out of the corners. But how do you do this? You have to have a sense of where you are in the ring at all times. and You turn your man so that your back is to the open part of the ring. And the way this is done is by daily drills of what Eddie called escapology. You fake right and spin left, or fake left and spin right, and you have to figure out how to do it with different opponents. These habits need to be drilled into a beginner. If you pay attention, you can see complete fighters down through the ages using these tactics, and it's because they practiced it in the gym all the time. Going to the ropes is what tired fighters do, and it reduces your mobility and sets you up to get knocked out.